hello guys welcome to the next video on bootstrap tutorial for beginners in this video we will see how to use models in bootstrap so first of all what is a model model is just like a pop-up box or a pop-up window on top of your uh, web page okay so it will appear on top of your uh, web page uh, for showing uh, something for example for showing some uh, login form or for showing some contact information or anything so let's see how we can uh, create a model in bootstrap so first of all uh, go to your uh, html code and in here first of all we will create a button which uh, we will use to open a model so just create a button and uh, in this button this will be first of all type is equal to button and then the class will be equal to btn btn and let's say it's a danger button okay and then we will add some more attributes to it first is data toggle so data toggle and this will be equal to model okay so just write model here and the second attribute we are going to add here is data target and this will be equal to uh, the name which you will set to reference the model so you can just write a hash and define any name of uh, your choice for example my model or uh, any other name okay so now using this id we are going to create or call a model okay so now we are going to uh, create an actual body of model so just add a div tag here and add this id so we will reference this id here first of all which is my model okay so just give it here the second thing is we will uh, call a class called model fade so model minus fade i think this will be only model fade thus this kind and we will define one more attribute here which will be role and it's a dialog okay now inside this div tag we will add one more div tag like this so div and we will add a class called class is equal to model dialog so model dialog this okay now inside this uh, model dialog we will add the content of the model okay so just add one more div element div and this time this will be the model content so add a class called model minus content okay and inside the content it will work like normal body of html page you can say it has a header and the body and the footer so we will add three more divs here first of all div for the model header so model first of all class class is equal to model minus header and this will contain the header of the model in the same way we will add two more div second is the model body and third is the model footer okay so this is our basic model you can uh, write something here something like model header and here you can write model body and here you can write model footer okay and save it and we will refresh our page and we will see this uh, button 
and when you click this button it's going to show this model this button we haven't uh, included uh, anything uh, as a text so let's add some text to it so this button is open model okay save it once again we are going to refresh our page and just click mo open model and it's going to open this kind of pop-up box which has header and the body and the footer but uh, you will notice here that there is nothing to close this model okay so there should be some uh, uh, x symbol or some close button to close this model so to add this uh, close symbol or button what we can do here is in the footer for example we want to add uh, this close button so what we are going to do here inside the footer we are going to create this button button and inside this first of all we will add uh, this type which will be button second we will add a class which will be btn and for closing let's uh, add btn default for example btn default okay and then we will add one more attribute which will be data dismiss so add this class data minus dismiss and this will be not with double s it will be single s and then just write model here okay and as a text you can write here close and save it and refresh your web page and click open model and now we have close uh, button which we press and it's closed in the same way you can add this x symbol to the header so just go and copy this button here and inside the modal header we have this uh, modal header here and just after this we can add uh, this button but this time it will be of uh, class close so just add close and the text here will be our x symbol so it's something like and times like this okay save it and refresh your page and open model and you see here this x symbol which you click and it will be disappeared okay now uh, one more thing you can add to the header which is uh, for example this div tag you can add div and here you can add a class called modal minus title and in here you can add your title in uh, any tag for example h1 tag or any other tag you can uh, add it okay so save it and refresh your page and once again open model it will be like this but we can see uh, this x symbol is uh, down and this is a uh, little bit above to adjust this we can just uh, place this uh, div at the bottom and instead of uh, using this div you can use h4 tag or h3 tag something like this save it and once again refresh this web page and now you can see this header which is a title and this uh, closing button closing button and the body in the body you can add uh, any div uh, any html tag for example you want to add a paragraph you can just add something like this add a paragraph and inside this paragraph you can add some text for example this lorem ipsum something like this save it and close this and refresh it open modal and now your text is here okay so in this way you can use model one more thing if you want to uh, use this model with for example about uh, this about uh, navigation bar button 
you can uh, do it also so for example what we want to do is with this about button we want to uh, open this uh, model so what we can do instead of uh, using this uh, button just copy this data toggle and data target from here and uh, place it in the about uh, list item here so just add it here in the link tag okay now i'm going to delete this button because we are not going to use it now save it and refresh your page and now when you click this about button you will see this model okay and you can close it so you can call it from here or using any button so i hope you enjoyed this video please wait comment and subscribe and bye for